Yo, what's going on guys? This is Roger from OTR Gaming TV. Now, I know a lot of you have been asking how the hell should we make money in the crew. As you guys seen, I've, had, I've got a lot of money in the crew. So in this video, I'm going to break it down and give you the top 5 tips on how to make money fast and quickly in the crew. Okay. Okay, so the first way to earn money in the crew is through faction spoils. Faction spoils are awarded to those players who play the crew every 24 hours, basically every single day. Faction spoils are a way of the crew rewarding those who are loyal to the game and, and play it. Now, faction spoils give you money every single day. To earn more faction spoils, I'm going to show you how to do that basically. To earn more, you need to obviously be in a faction which everybody already is. Secondly, you need to take part in any type of crew activity whether that's pvps story missions um now you've got the new crate missions you've got faction missions anything to give to get your rank up right will increase your rank in your faction so as you can see i'm showing you i'm part of the bears faction right and my rank is pretty high my next uh my next promotion will give me actually thirty five thousand every time i turn on my game so faction spoils basically award you with money Every time you turn on your game, the more you play the crew, not just drive around in it, but the actually you have to actually like do missions, do activities to increase your rank in your faction. And the, the higher the rank in the faction, the more you get paid every time you turn it on. That lasts for 30 days. So there's a time limit. So when those 30 days run out, you actually end up basically re-ranked. So you start again from the bottom where you earn like two grand, seven grand, any like that type of money. Now, moving on to the second way of making money. The second best way of making money is to do faction missions. If you're not really good at PVPs, you should stick to faction missions. Faction missions can be done on your own, so solo, or in a crew. If you do them in a crew, you can get a crew bonus. You can earn more money from it. Now, the one I'm about to show you is basically a perf race, which lasts two and a half hours. But obviously, if you can drive really fast and you do have a fast car, you can complete it in... Uh, I think one hour and forty minutes, and you're awarded with one hundred and sixty thousand. So now that's almost like doing ten PVPs. So it works out evenly. So you, that's the best way to make the most money. If you're not really a good driver, or if you don't feel like racing against other players, you end up racing against AI. It's a faction mission. You can play with your crew. It does last a lot. That race particularly goes around the whole of the map. I think it's the outside of the map. So you literally go through every. Um, city within the US literally Miami to LA to New York etc all the way around that awards you with 160,000 so if you could do that once a day when you play the crew you can imagine doing that let's say 10 days in a row that's 1.6 million right there you know doing it with a crew member I think if you do it with all four crew members or three crew members you earn even more money and you have to come top three so it is kind of hard you can't be losing you have to literally beat AI there's about five six AIs in there so yeah, that is the second best way to earn money in the crew. Now my third tip would be um, to tweak your perks. Now I'm in, the, I'm in the HQ right now, headquarters, and I'm going to go to the perk section. There you go, I'm at perks now. Now when you're in the perk section, go all the way to the end. And I think it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be with Vincent. So yeah, third one, it's called MVP. Now once you have this perk maxed out, so you have to have actually five out of five points. You earn 10% more XP, so experience points, and money from PvP events. So this perk will give you 10% more money in PvP events. Now it doesn't matter what position you come in. So even if you come in last, and the you know you get you get let's say 5,000, and the, the, the winner gets about 10,000, right? If you become you know if you're last, you still get 10% extra of whatever that prize was. So 5,000, 10% of that is 5,000 is 500, so it would be 5,500. The second perk to have is Roxanne, which is a notorious perk. This basically gives you more reputation, um, more reputation points earned from faction missions and PvP events. So the higher your rep, right, the more money you get, as I said, in the in in your faction spoils in the beginning of the game. So those two combined guys will give you basically good money. Like you won't even realize it. When you have those perks maxed out and you're doing missions and whatnot, you know, you get more reputation and you get more money. So with Vincent, it will be good to have it. So every time you win a PvP event, you get 10% more. Whatever position really you become, you get 10% more. And with uh, Roxanne, you end up getting 
10% more reputation. So yeah, combine those two packs and you will end up earning more money. Now, my fourth tip to make money in the crew is actually simple, to do the daily challenges. Now, with the daily challenges, you can earn up to 5,000, 20,000, or 100,000. The daily challenges is actually reset every, I think, three days. So, you know, you can't earn 100,000 every day. But you can rack up an easy 125,000 if you complete that challenge and you don't have money. So imagine you have literally you know, 10,000, you can earn 125,000 by just completing those daily challenges. Simple as that, no hard no hard thoughts. To, to look at the daily challenges, you literally press, I think you open up the map, and then you press the L3 button down. <laughs> by pressing the L3 button down, you open up the driver ID, which basically brings up the challenges. So yeah, easy, easy way, easy, easy way to make money. The daily challenges. Now my final tip to make the best money literally the most money in probably the shortest amount of time is to do pvp pvp is basically player versus player lobbies now you have to enter a public pvp session in order to actually make money and get ranked up me and my friends literally spent hours on pvps you know you're racing other people you're making a, sh a ton of money basically a ton of money even if you lose in the PvP, guys, this is what I told my friends. Even if you lose, right, you will still earn a lot of money. So we'll be doing a lot of races. So, for example, the race that we normally do, Liberty, Race of Liberty, you know, the perf race, no collisions, no traffic. We tried to put it on anyway. But obviously, with, with, a, with a PvP public session, everyone gets to choose a race. So, you know, you don't always get the race that you want. But given that example of Race for Liberty, the winner... With the perks that I mentioned earlier, you know, the MVP perk and the crew perk. If you win, you get around 17,000, right? Sorry, no, no. Race for Liberty. You get about... Let's just say the Daytona one, yeah. Daytona one, you get about 17,000. The winner, right? The loser will literally walk away with about 15,000. Literally, the loser, the person that comes last. So, two grand less, guys. That's, you know, that's still a lot of money for doing one race, you know? So you you do that race about ten times, right? That's one hundred and fifty thousand right there for you. Easy money, guys. PVP is literally the best way to make money and reputation. Now the bonus thing is, when you're earning more reputation, like I mentioned earlier, with the uh, the faction spoils that you get in the beginning of the game, every time you do PVPs, your reputation increases quickly. So you're ranking up in your faction. So now you're getting promoted in your faction. So when you turn on your game, you're actually going to be earning more faction spoils every time you turn on your PS4 because or your PC, whatever, whatever you play the crew on, because your reputation has increased and your rank in your faction has increased, so you're getting more money. So that's how I earn a lot of money. Like right now, when I when I when this update came, I had about four million. I spent almost three million, and I'm back to two point five million. You know, my car's my car, my Skyline, as you can see. It's maxed out. I got a Maserati maxed out. I got a Ferrari's maxed out. I got loads of literally a ton of cars, guys. So that will be my final tip. PVPs. If you have nothing else to do, literally join the PVP. If you want to play with your crew, there's actually a crew versus crew PVP lobby public as well. So go for that. Um, but that does take a lot of time to find. I don't know why. I don't think anyone does it. That's why. You know, normally me and my crew, we literally just enter free for all. We play against other people. Win or lose, we're still earning money. Um, and yeah, anyway guys, I know a lot of you are asking for how to make money in the crew, hope this, these five tips help you out, if you enjoyed the video and found it informative, please do share it guys, we need the support, we, we do appreciate the support, like, comment, share, and of course if you haven't already, subscribe, and we'll definitely be having a lot more videos coming out, if you have any requests, also drop that below, and Anyway, guys, this is Roger from OTR Gaming TV. I'm going to let you go, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.